What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, my name is Brie Monet and today's video is going to come from Love Me Hair, of course. So y'all already know what comes in the box. We got a wig cat, we got our user guide. Y'all, the user guide is super important. Make sure you're using it. We also have our little goodie pouch with our earrings, our elastic band, and an edge brush. So this is the way that they sent me. It's a blonde highlight bob with bangs. It's a 13 by 4 frontal and it's a C part short wig and it's 100% human hair. And y'all already know uh, with the elastic band, this one is sewn in. But this is what the lace looks like on the back of my hand. So we going to get right into this. So I'm going to put on the wig. Um, so far, it was giving me very much. I'm the head of the house. I'm head honcho. It's giving me very much a boss lady vibe. So we love that. So I clipped my hair back so my hair wouldn't get away when I was cutting it. Y'all, I had to do this off camera because it was irritating me. The hair kept getting away. But this is what it looks like when it's all done and cut. So now we just need to glue this down. You could wear this glueless, but I don't recommend wearing a 13 by 4 glueless at all. I recommend that with closures. Then we're going to use my girl got to be because she got to be tacky when you put the lace down, okay? You got to wait two to three minutes. I actually ended up washing the wig because I forgot to take my makeup off underneath and it was making like the glue not stick so I did end up washing the wig you will see um but we're just going to blow dry that you'll do the same steps and we're going to press that down then we're going to use the cute little elastic band that they sent us because we need that lace to melt in baby so now I'm going to part my uh hair on the side um it already came in the side part but it came on the left I like my part on the right so then I'm just going to take my wax stick make sure that our hair is laying flat i will say make sure you choose what part you want your hair to be in so you could do a middle part if you want to or you could choose either side um it's a lot of things that you could actually do with this wig since it is full lace um so i'm just going to bump my ends make sure that i'm flat ironing it after you know i washed it and blow dried it and y'all i didn't put anything in this wig and it still has that shine and body to it i love it so i ended up cutting um the other side just to make it even and then i put concealer in my part but y'all oh my mama oh my who it is the perfect body yo i'm in freaking love with this we need to get into review right now so you guys, this is the wig and y'all, I'm in love with this bob. I'm living for the side part, okay? I feel like the blonde streaks in the front really frame the face and it just, mm, it's doing a lot for me right now, it's giving. I definitely love the fact that it's almost like peekaboo highlights because once I lift this side up, this side as well, you will also see the highlights. And then this is what it looks like up close. Now the hairline for me was a little bit tricky only because like in this area it was bunching up. I did cut exactly to the hairline. It's more lace like right here versus like right here. And of course I didn't want to like leave lace with no hairline there, like no hair there because then it's just going to look really weird. So I just decided to cut it exactly the way that they have the hairline. So I had to finesse it. And also even like when I move my head, it moves with me. It was very flowy and soft. I didn't get any tangles, but I did get some shedding, but nothing out of like the norm. And I'm glad to say that with this 13 by 4 wig, sometimes it's a little bit too small to the point where like my edges will show and I would have to like swoop them in to the lace to kind of like hide it. This one was big head friendly to the point where I didn't have to do that and I could actually put it over like my natural hairline. I'm very glad because it was a struggle. Okay, it was a struggle. Also for the spring slash summertime, I feel like this is perfect because not a lot of people like long hair. They really are into bobs because there's really nothing touching your shoulders. I think this is very cute for that. And let me tell you something. I know that we are in springtime now, but I went outside and I said, Lord knows how this summer is going to feel because it was hot. I was sweating. So let me turn around so you guys can see the back of the wig. <laughs> So with this, you could part it on either side. Um, the part for this actually came on the left side, but I like my parts on my right side because I have more earrings on this side. So I just changed it up. Um, so that kind of gives you an idea that this wig is versatile. So you can have it on either side. 
Also, you could put it in a middle part and I'm pretty sure you could put this in a half up, half down because it is full lace. You will have to cut it just so it can match your ears. Um, the lace was like all the way down here and I was like, I don't know what mannequin that y'all had this on, but my ears ain't that low. Um, so I definitely had to cut it to fit my ear. But I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like in a middle part just to show you. Okay, after a lot of hot combing, this is where we are. So this is what the middle part will look like. He honestly, I prefer the side part, but I just want to show you guys what you could do with this wig. It's even on both sides. Again, it's like that blunt cut. Per size, okay, never miss, always hit. I think my favorite to wear this in is the side part, then the half up, half down, and then of course the middle part. But as you can see, it has like a natural shine to it. So if I had to rate this from one to 10, I'm definitely going to give this a 10. I'm in love with this bob. I just love like the different lengths that it gives. I just think it looks really good like that. Like you have room to have like free parting in this wig. I love where they place the highlights. I think the highlights look great on this wig. So yeah, I really like this bob wig. So I think you guys are going to like it too if you do decide to purchase this. So that is all I have for you guys today. And if you're looking to purchase this wig or anything else that they may have on their website, make sure you check out the description box down below. Also check out my Amazon storefront. Like, comment, subscribe, follow me on all my social medias. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.